Hey guys, hope you're having a great day. Today I opened the front door and for the first time actually screamed and because I was being murdered, but because my friend's box came, I ordered this months ago and I didn't even know it existed until people started getting theirs. And I'm like, are you serious? Because I have loved friends since the very first episode. People told me in the first season, the show is dumb. It's not gonna be anything. Like, why do you like the show? It's so stupid. Gosh, I think I was like in, oh God, what grade was I in? I had to have been in, I think eighth grade when the first season of Friends came out. So I've been watching Friends since I was about 13 years old. I was begging at 13 years old when I was at my dad's mom's house. I was like, please let me get my hair cut like Rachel. And they're like, no, what if you hate it? I'm like, come on. So finally, when I went to Florida, I think it was years later that I finally after being 18 was able to get the Rachel do and I did get it if I can find a picture I'll put it here too but I've been a huge fan of friends I think it's really sad that the the lady that plays Rachel Jennifer Aniston she hated the Rachel do but she said that that's what they wanted to do because they said that was like the best look for her face or something like that but anyways I've been a long time friends fan so this is the second box but I'm not sure if they sent me the same one I don't know because it says season one so I thought this would say season two since I missed the first one but who knows so it says welcome to the real world it sucks you're gonna love it so that's one of the things that was said on friends in one of the episodes so I'm, I'm really excited about this this is so cool I never thought anything like this would ever like exist <laughs> so if you want to subscribe to this box I'll put a link in the description below it's a referral I don't know if I get anything or if you get anything but Oh my gosh. Okay, so it's definitely a new one because this is not what people got the last time. So you get this little postcard and on the other side shows everything that's on it. So I'm trying not to look. I'm just going to put that to the side. So the first thing I see here. Oh wow, it's a huge Friends jersey. This is everything. What? That's so cool. It has 94 on the back. This is nice. I had said that I was a 2X, 3X. This is definitely a 3X. I'm more of a 1X, 2X. But I mean, I guess it's better to have bigger than smaller, right? So yeah, this is gonna be nice, but I'm pretty sure it's a little too big, but we could try it on right now. It does smell like not good, but I mean, I'm gonna wash it with some Tide with Febreze and I'm sure it'll be good to go. Like this just seems really big, even just for me. Oh, it stinks so bad. Like, I'm not even gonna try to lie about that. It smells like fish oil or something. I don't know. <clears throat> Let's see if I can fix the... Let me back up a little bit. Ah, oh, that is so cute. I thought it would be, like, crazy too big. I mean, it's definitely, like, bulky, but it's comfy. But I would like wear it over another shirt for sure. This is cute. Okay, so, so far I do like this. Let me see if I can read what's on the postcard without hockey jersey. Okay, cause obviously, you know, Joey and Chandler like to play hockey and watch hockey and all that fun stuff. So, all right, so now we have Marcel! I was so sad when Marcel left, but it had to have been hard to have a monkey on the set and like training him and stuff like that. So I can see kind of why he got written off, but so cute. Oh, this is so cute. It's Marcel. That is awesome. So we got the Friends logo here and all that stuff. And wow, this is cool. It says built by Culture Fly. That's cute. Try to see if this smells. Like everything kind of has like a smell to it. So that's cool. That's so cute. <laughs> All right. Then we got a guitar. That's also sticky notes. That's cute. I don't know what I would use this for. Like maybe a phone number or something like that. All right. Let's see. Ooh, there's something in this box. Ooh, oh no, what? What is this? 
It looks like, you know, like I'm being proposed to or something. Wow. Okay, let's see. Oh, wow. That's cool. If you don't remember, Rachel, she looked at this pendant and she really liked it in the window and Ross remembered and bought it for her and surprised her. Wow. I wish they would write on here, like what's what. So like, just in case you have a brain fart like me or if like you don't remember something, like you could remember, but I'm pretty sure I'm like 100% on the mark with that, that this was something Rachel wanted and like Ross remembered. And that's when she, they like, that's when she realized like how much he really loved her. Like that was just like a big sign. All right, what's in here? I feel like at this point, if you're worried about spoilers for friends, it's, it's been out since forever. So this is a little soda bottle. Oh my God, are you serious? I remember this episode. So Phoebe found a thumb in her soda. So that's what that is. Oh my Lord. I remember that episode. <laughs> so that's what that is. That's kind of creative. All right, what else do we have? Welcome to the real world. It sucks. You're going to love it. This looks like an agenda book, possibly, or a little journal. And then on the front, it says, how you doing? How you doing? All right. Yes. This I could use more than the post-it notes because there's a lot more room. But the post-it notes still are cute. You know, a little guitar because Phoebe plays guitar. There's a video on here where I went to the set of friends per se like it was the eight it was an AT&T store made to be recreated as like the coffee shop and then I was able to sing like Phoebe but I was like so sick that day so it kind of sucked but I'll put a link to those in the below so you can see the coffee shop everything recreated I took some pictures I sang a song sing one of Phoebe's songs on there like with the guitar too in the coffee shop but this guy just like walked in front of me but it was it was a really fun time my husband surprised me that day so it was cool um, but I, fun fact, I actually worked on the set of Friends for real. So I worked at the studios like a long time ago. I worked on Two and a Half Men. I worked on Less is Less Than Perfect. I worked on Just Shoot Me. I worked on that 70s show. I worked on Will and Grace. I worked on like a lot of shows. But the one show I asked to never work on was Friends because I loved it. I loved to be able to go home and just relax. And it was like... You know, I, I was like so involved in the characters that I knew if I saw the set, it would like not be the same, you know, because like then when I because anytime I went home and I watched any show I worked on, I would see the layout like I'd, I would see the cameras. I would see like where the set was and it just kind of like ruined it for me. But one day there was an emergency and I had to work on Friends. So I did see the whole layout. The coffee shop is way smaller in real life. Like the way they could do the camera angles is insane because it, it's like way small like when you were there in person and um it didn't really ruin it for me I guess but it was just it was weird I got to meet Matthew Perry um Jennifer Aniston was not there that day she was filming a movie with Jim Carrey so she had like a body double that day and then she would like fill her scenes in later um but the only person I really did meet I mean I walked by people but I mean the only person I actually had a conversation with was um Matthew Perry which was very short he said hi uh, to me and I said hi back <laughs> it was kind of funny because we were not allowed to talk to them like if they talk to us it's okay to respond but we were told like at any show like do not talk to the celebrities unless you're talked to because they just don't want us to get in trouble so the day that Matthew Perry said hi to me I looked behind me because I thought he was talking to somebody else and when I realized he was talking to me I'm like hi <laughs> it was so awkward because like I had to go do something after that I was like rushing to like the front gate to to get somebody I don't know maybe like a late audience member or something like that because I dealt with the audience but anyways we have one more thing left I worked on the episode where Monica thought that Chandler was into shark porn so <laughs> that was that was a fun episode to work on let's see Ooh, what is this I mean I'm pretty sure I know what it is but like I don't know what the right words are to say so I want to screw it up it is a poker set. I've actually never played poker. This is nice because we're all in quarantine, right? So it comes with a deck of cards and a whole bunch of poker chips. That is cool. So maybe my husband and I can play. I don't I don't know how to play poker and I, I'm messing up putting this back in. But that is everything, you guys. So these are what the poker chips look like. 
This one says friends. This one says 94, just like this jersey. This one says, welcome to the world. It sucks, you're gonna love it. I think that's like it. I think it's, yeah. So basically the theme of this box is welcome to the real world. It sucks, you're gonna love it. This would've been perfect for a graduate, like somebody that just is graduating um, high school right now because he's like, welcome to the real world. It sucks, you're gonna love it. So this is like perfect for that. But unfortunately, like if you subscribe today, you're not gonna get this one. It's, it's, that's how it works, you know? You like, you subscribe and then a few months later you get it. So, um, and then I, I love the last box like so much that I was gonna go on eBay and try to get it. But the people jacked up the prices so much cause they know like it's a one time thing. You can't get it. I think it was like $200 and I'm like, nah, <laughs> I'm good. But yeah, this box is so cute. I'm definitely gonna say subscribe just cause I just love friends so much. It's really creative, it's really cute. I believe it's $39.99. I try looking for a promo code everywhere under the sun and I could not find one. So I'm just letting you know there, like you can try to find a promo code, but good luck. But I will give you my referral. Maybe you will save something that way. I'm not sure because I didn't have a referral when I signed up. So but that's super cute and I love this French jersey. I feel like it makes me look bigger than I am though. Like maybe if I get out of the car, it won't be so bad, but I feel like it makes me look bigger than I am. So let me take this off, but it is super cute. But I don't know, I'll have to look at an actual mirror to see how I actually feel about it. Cause like, look, I just feel like I lost like 20 pounds. All right, well, that is the friends box. I will see you guys the next time I get one. I feel like it's quarterly, so you might not see another video about the friends box for like two months or three months or whatever. So, but stick around this channel. I like to do mukbangs, unboxings, and random things. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.